So today I'm just going to do a what's in my bag video real quick, real simple. Um, I've been getting a lot of questions about what do I carry in that ginormous bag that I have with me at all times. So here's what's in it. The bag that I'm carrying is a very huge handbag. Um, I want it for selling Mary Kay. I'm a Mary Kay beauty consultant, so I won this. It's got just like a little Mary Kay keychain. It's really pretty. Champagne color. Um, it's got a middle class like a little magnet and stuff. And this is really heavy, guys. <laughs> but this is what the inside of it looks like. It's got a zipper pocket here and then on the inside. It's got two little pockets right here. So we will just get going with this. Starting with the big pocket, I have my 31 wristlet. Um, it's very dirty. I need to wash it, but I don't really carry much of anything in here except for my loose change. Um, until it's pretty empty, but in this uh, zipper pocket right here, I have my loose change. I'm not going to open it because it will go everywhere. So yeah, that's that. Don't carry my license or anything in it unless... I absolutely have to. So that's that. And then I have my Mary Kay body lotion. It's in warm amber and it smells so great. I wear this all the time. This is going to be my April favorites. Um, I carry body lotion with me all the time. And simply because I have really, really dry skin and I cannot go without moisturizing. I do this after I get out of the tanning bed and before I go to bed, after I get out of the shower, you gotta have lotion. I mean, and it smells awesome. I love it. But I switched it up. Last month I was using the Exotic Passion Fruit from Mary Kay and I decided that I wanted to switch it up because I switch perfumes and I don't know it just it seemed to fit me better I love this smell so I got this and this will be in my April favorites video for sure so that's that next in the big bag is there's a lot of stuff in here my eyeglasses I am currently wearing contacts, but yeah, these are my glasses, my little contact case, I can't even talk guys, oh my gosh, um, my contact case has a new solution in it, I always keep new solution, so, but check out these glasses guys, they are awesome, I know I'm blonde, but look at the dragonfly, how cute is that, excuse my nails, they are hideous, I've got to get them redone, and someone is messaging me on Facebook, what is that? But yeah. Next, I have my Mary Kay Bella Bolera perfume. This is the perfume wand. It has a little drawer that comes out. I love it. And a little pouch that they are burning me up. Oh my gosh. But I'll show you what it looks like. It comes in this little pouch. And this is $15. I love this stuff. And it looks like this. Can't really see the name. Hang on, guys. But yeah. I had to shut my Facebook down. They weren't going to leave me alone. But... It smells really great. I wear it all the time. Love it. This was limited edition. So I, I had to get it. So, but yeah. That goes with the little box. So that's that. Next is my tan bed lotion. And it is Brown Envy. And it doesn't smell all that great whenever you put it on. It kind of smells, I don't know. 
But I do know after you get it put on and you get in the tiny bed and then you start laying and you all that heat and everything starts going. Um, it smells like vanilla, French vanilla, and I love the smell of vanilla. So I got this. So and that's the the brand of it. Synergy tan. I got it for sixteen dollars. I bought it at my tanning salon. So I don't know, but I know it's on Amazon. I know that you can get it on Amazon, but that's my tan lotion. This is my my everyday wallet. Um, it's the Chanel and it's pink and black. And the story behind this wallet is, I bought the big purse, the big pink and black purse, Chanel, and from a woman here in town. And she sold me the purse for ninety dollars, and she left the wallet in there. And I went and got my hair done, and she called the the hairstylist and she was like oh my gosh that girl owes me for that wallet and I was like you know so I ended up having paying thirty dollars for this wallet but the thing was she did not know that she had a real Chanel I went and I had it looked at because I thought that it was a fake but it's not it's a real Chanel it's a real Chanel wallet a real Chanel purse so I got off pretty cheap if you ask me <laughs> This was my 16th birthday present. I'm 21 now, so it's, this has lasted me forever. And it still looks brand new, except for some spots. But I love my Chanel wallet. Yeah. Um, I can't really show you much of anything in here other than it's really nice. It's really big. Um, just got some money, some checkbooks, some. I got my Sally's card and stuff like that. Just my regular, like, Rite Aid card. And, Big Lots card, subway card, that kind of thing. Um, I don't keep any loose change in this. So, my debit card, my license, my social security card, that kind of thing, always stays in my, my wallet. I'm very paranoid about wrecking, and nobody knows who I am. They won't be able to identify me, so I always keep everything with me. I know that's bad, but, you know, I will take my chances. Okay, I have a clip. A lot of people ask me, why do you wear tighter chip clips in your hair? This is not a tighter chip clip. I have a ton of these things. I bought them from Sally's Beauty Supply, and I wear them all the time. I wear these more than I do just the regular, like, little elastic bands. I love these things. I'm never going to have too many of them. Then I have my makeup bag. Um, this come with my Trouble Roll bag that I won from Mary Kay. So it's got all my Mary Kay makeup in it. Um, uh, if you want to know what's in my makeup bag or what's in my makeup collection or whatever, just leave me a comment below because it's going to take me forever to go through this stuff. Some of you guys, I love my Mary Kay. So that's all that's in this is my makeup. Um, We'll go with the two side pockets right here. First thing, do not judge me. I know that this is a bad habit and I am currently in the process of quitting. Um, I have cigarettes on the ladder. Um, this is a new pack. I went and bought it. Um, they're actually not the right kind that I smoke. But I asked for a special blend and she gave me just the regular lights. I didn't know it until I got halfway through town and I was like, ah. you know, I only smoke whenever I get upset or I get stressed out or I get sick or something. So, I have those. Don't judge me. Smoking is terrible. But I have gum. This is a new pack. I went and bought it today. Always have gum because I always have this thing that my breath always stinks. I feel like it even though it doesn't because I brush my teeth like crazy. And I do mouthwash and stuff. So, I mean, but I always have gum. In high school, everybody was like, do you have gum, Liz? And I'm like, yeah. Everybody always came to me for gum. So that's what I have in that. Um, I have my earrings that I've had for like ever. I love these things. And they're tangled up. And I think that's why I didn't take them out. Um, but yeah. 
they, they just look like this. Um, I love these earrings. I have to get them untangled. Um, then I have my iPhone four. It's black. Um, oh my gosh. Yeah, there's been a lot of people like. <laughs> I know you couldn't see that, but there's been a lot of people blow me up. Yeah, I I've had this iPhone. Um, maybe three weeks and I love it. Um, my ex-husband threw it out the car window and I actually have the otter box for it. I was going like 65 miles per hour and he tossed my phone out the window because he was mad at me and yeah the only thing I had the otter box on it the only thing that happened was that little tear right there. So yeah and my iPhone works. I'm glad because I would be lost without my iPhone. I love it. I had a blackberry torch and I hated it. I just could not text on it, could not talk on it. It was just, it was crazy. So I just went and got the iPhone for my birthday. So yeah, I don't really like the Otter Box. I'm gonna get like a different case because I don't know. I just I don't like the feeling of the rubber. Yeah, that's what those two pockets consisted of. The zipper side pocket right here. Um, it has my car keys. My lanyard that I can't really show you because then you know where I live. I have my Mary Kay, my car keys, stuff like that. Um, and then I have pins because you never know when somebody's going to want to buy Mary Kay and I have to fill out order forms. Um, I did have my date book in it, but I booked parties earlier, and I kind of had to have my date book, so I just didn't put it back in. Um, but yeah, gotta have pins. But guys, that looks like that's everything from my what's in my purse. It is completely empty. So, if you liked what you saw. And you want to see more videos, I'm actually getting ready to film probably tomorrow a um, everyday natural eye look. And the lighting in my bedroom is terrible, so I film in my bathroom. Um, so look for that. It probably won't be up tomorrow, but it, maybe in a couple days. Um, I'm going to do a walkthrough of my American inventory too. Um, just some skincare tutorials, introduce you to some new stuff. Then um, I'll do a what's in my shower video. And I'm going to repaint my room. So I'll do a what's, you know, like a room tour or whatever. But that's all for the video. And I will talk to you later. Bye.